So, I'd like to welcome you uh, haste to uh, my craptastic presentation of Jane's Longbow. Alright, so tonight, well, yesterday I was doing Comanche Gold, did all the silver campaigns, and I'm like, I don't want to do all the gold ones. So, it's like, why not do another helicopter uh, game that has a gold compilation? So, Jane's Longbow Gold. So, disc one, training, and uh, Baltic Hammer, disc three is Morning Fury. We're going to be doing stuff on disc 2 of the install, so basically every classical operation. So where are we? Panama, 1989, Operation Just Cause. Space, destroy the SAM sites, okay. Okay. Right. Panama Canal. Right. Okay. Clear the airfields of all SAM AAA threats prior to the arrival of C-130s. Okay, midnight. Zero precipitation, southeast winds. Okay. Flight and SAM activity must be eliminated. Okay. Do MPS SAM rockets for both of us. Laser Hellfire since we're taking the classical Apaches. Alright. So this is the yeah. Alright. So everything around waypoint two. Okay. Level of detail uh, installs. APR 39, power up, shelf test, set, volume, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, APR 39, operation. Scooter, clear for takeoff, pilot's discretion. And, uh, because I'm not playing on Realistic Collective, uh, the speed is capped, but also, uh, craft is a little bit smoother for me to deal with. But then again, it's like, I really shouldn't be flying faster than 150 knots for these sorts of things anyway. So if we go full speed, we'll be there in about four and a half minutes. Eh, slow our progress. I don't want to be cruising in and, uh, crashing into something or uh, cruising past an entire, uh, Place full of uh, man pad stingers. I make that about five minutes. Uh, I'm not in any big hurry to be there.
it. Campsite, your 12 o'clock. Usually it's better to come in low and slow rather than bruising and bruising. Uh, Sam site, you're 12 o'clock. I have a good view at that. Yes, I do. Ow! Wasn't paying attention to that. Take out the radar sights first and then take out the launcher second. Sam site, you are 12 o'clock. Unless the launchers are fully dependent on the radar. Alright. Copy. Attacking your target, sir. Firing hellfire. Sir. 
I know they're not primary targets, but you were Sam's and Triple A we have to deal with coming in. Well, or it will be. Especially if it doesn't look like there's any other route alongside them where next route over just takes way, way too long. Soldiers probably have stingers to take care of these guys. Threat front. Those guys can come with uh, rifles or stingers or RPGs. Now what I should have done was uh, poke my head out with a spear and did a little bit of scanning the area. Here. Triple A, you were three o'clock. You're 12 o'clock. Hot damn. Threat front. Missile away. Hellfire away. Crap, I lost the track.
above block. Triple A, front. Engaging with cannon. All right. told what a primary target was. It was just softening up the air defense before uh, C-130s come in. Based on our performance, well, at least we punched up in a good enough hole. Number two, Ruby 7. So I 
which one is this one? Oh, take a nice coastal approach. Take out whatever's on this LZ. Alright, some radars and the uh, and the like. Fields of all Sam, AAA, and locate and destroy the hangar containing a uh, private jet. Okay. They okay, bring the SEAL team. Alright. I'll destroy the jets as much as I care. As long as we take out the AAA and make sure the SEALs make it on the ground, that's fine. Okay. One of the missions I like is it takes the Coastal approach. Power up. Self test. Set. Volume. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. APR. Thirty nine. Operation. Scooter cleared for takeoff. Pilot's discretion. I mean, cruise over open ocean, it doesn't look like there's going to be much air threats watching along the coast, and we're still in safe territory for the time being. Alright, the nice little details about whether you're in the cockpit or uh, gunner seat.
to turn inland. I think the Pathfinder said this was the easiest approach to get in. Okay, Pavlos are coming in. Alright. <clears throat> so, yeah, I think they'll be following the same way route we are. I'll be at a little bit slower and heavier, more like the advanced element that's supposed to be taking out uh, all the air defense, so... Low-level SEAD. Gotta love it. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Copy that. Bend, 12 o'clock. You go nuts. Firing hellfire. Copy. Weapons free, sir. Missile away. Good shot, sir. Primary target in sight. 12 o'clock. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. I just want to... Hold still. Thank you. Good shot, sir. It's a play. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. Threat front. Good shot, sir. Sam side uh, in the backfield. All right. Let's go in. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Shoot troops that far away. Hellfire away. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. Firing hellfire. Engaging with cannon. Good shot, sir. Threat boats. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. Hellfire away. Hellfire away. We're pitch under hellfire. Hot damn. Ah! Hot. Bloody hate that. I mean, the landing's on easy, so... At least I hope it's on easy. No, not that. Yeah, that. Mid-quality troops. I'm not doing pros, and... One time I was doing Flashpoint Korea, I'm like, Wait a minute, why are all the helos not shooting back? It's like... Oh, the enemy AI is on, like, 1 out of 10. I'm like, well, that's no fun. Like, I wonder why the Heinz didn't want to shoot back. So, yeah, I made sure the difficulty slider's at mid-range. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. Yep. 39. Failure. APU. Failure. APU. Gonna have to set her down, sir. Hot damn. Crap. Suck engaging with cannon. Is the side optic still We're going down? What? Oh shit. 
So, all I have is the guns. And, uh, yeah, everything is just busted. Well, that sucks. Can't launch the Hellfires. I hope the payloads make it in time. Otherwise, uh, 10, 20, 50. Well, even the gun's fucked up, so. It looks like, uh. Can't tell if all my weapons are out, but looks like, uh. Yeah, they're out. At least the optics still work. Yeah. Place a few of them. Ah. Take the MFD shot. Where's the payblows? on fire by using the fire extinguisher. Doesn't look like any of the engines are shot, so I'm fine with that. I think all we can do is just to go home and hope for the best. Ah. It's all my wing man, he was weapons free. Unless we just both came in at a bad angle. I guess we got translational movement, so. And I know everything's shot down. You don't have to tell me. how to call it quits. You know, we sank the jet and everything, but uh looks like we did looks like the SEAL team didn't make it. Yeah, it's probably the autopilot shot as well, so Well I gotta take an L on this one.
That didn't go well. <sighs> He's like, mmm. One friendly fire and a f and a purple heart. APR thirty nine. Power up. Shelf tap. Set volume. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. APR thirty nine. Operation. Scooter cleared for takeoff. Pilot's discretion. Yeah, I just gotta have to love that look uh, of defeat on his face. Usually, depending on the campaign, you'll have some other. Uh, Nest, you'll have some other officer chewing uh, your pilot the fuck out, but uh, looks like that wasn't the case here. It's like you either. Well, I think that's if you fuck up really spectacularly, is when you get the officer chewing you out. middle of the ocean. Yeah, I don't want to do... Yeah. No, thank you. I don't know if my controls just jammed or something, but I'm like, okay, as long as I didn't fall in the drink, I'm like, Okay, that's fine. Yeah, because uh, that would be uh, quite the setback. So I'm supposed to be flying uh, more than ahead of the Pavlos. Copy that. Attacking your target, sir. Firing hellfire. Firing hellfire. 
You know, I'm just gonna set him to cover and uh, try to let him use his hellfires on uh, anything not named the uh, target of opportunity. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. All right. Take out the SAM sites or some of the other things while well, we're golden. Threat front, primary target in sight, 12 o'clock, hot day. Launching a Hellfire is a little bit overkill. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Engaging with cannon. Copy that. Weapons free, sir. Engaging with cannon. Firing Hellfire. Hot. Day. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. Hot. Day. Hellfire away. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. Learjet trashed. That's everyone. Got the directional head still on my radar and test argument. Yeah, it's like we took out pretty much everything on this airfield. Let's try to go home this time.
let's just fast forward this part. I think it's like the healers have to land in order for the mission to be a success. If they were driven back, then probably means no. Yeah, I don't know what changed this time. I did, just didn't kill those sky guards fast enough. Scooter cleared for landing. Pilot's discretion. Yeah, I think it's probably because the healers got driven back. Like if they land there, then it's a success. But otherwise. take out those triplays in the air. And I destroyed the jet and everything, and that should have counted, but I think you needed, you needed all three of the payblows to land. Ah. Uh. Secure the LZ. Alright. Jet and everything, but unless those payloads make land uh, with everybody, then it's the bust. Come back to that mission then. later. Stop, 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 stop. Copy that. Weapons free, sir. Target in sight, 12 o'clock. Firing, hellfire. Hellfire away. 
That's over with. We accomplished the mission. Ta -da -da. Threat front. Seven threat front to be like the easiest mission of the bunch. Or at least the air, the airfield strike mission probably would have been the easiest of the bunch. Well, it's the second easiest. Everything goes right. I'm just wondering. Yeah, did I just not make the Pavlos lamp because of that last triple A hanging around? Primary target in sight. One o'clock. Hellfire away. Let me revisit that when I do the other five. Good shot, sir. Threat front. Way out of it. Reach. It's like to try to shoot down Dr. Freeman. Engaging with Kenna. Engaging with Kenna. Oh, that's just Hot a, damn. That's just a down one person. Hot damn. Primary target in sight. 11 o'clock. Threat front. Engaging with Kenna. Hot damn. Roger. Attacking your target, sir. It's those guys with stingers. Scooter, cleared for takeoff. Pilot's discretion. Yep. That's 
that's what I was afraid of. Uh, guys uh, with man pad stingers. understand why my wingman wasn't covering me uh, those guys unless he was too busy taking out that APC yeah sometimes the best uh, thing when engaging targets is don't Yeah, 
let's try to fly around all those guys with man pads. Probably get on the ocean or somewhere where Threat front. they can't see us. All right. Missile away. Firing hellfire. Primary target in sight. Twelve o'clock. Good shot, sir. Let's go. Threat front. So we can stay out of their stinger range. Pretty good, but yeah, I'm not a uh, I'm not a good enough pilot at this. Much less a player. Yeah, just destroy the AAA and then just uh, get out of there. It's like, no telling at what range uh, those guys will want to use stingers or whether they're armed with rifles. But yeah, Ruby 7 tended to be a lot easier for me. I don't know what's different this time. Rubik's Cube is my favorite, or better yet, it's the easiest of the bunch. That's this one. Destroy vehicles. Okay, destroy PDF armor heavy. Moving toward Panama City. Okay. Some artillery. But, alright. This is like the easiest get in, get out mission, so. Not to worry about. Almost Sam's or the like. Scooter cleared for takeoff. Pilot's discretion. And yes, you can carry 16 Hellfires. No, the game sometimes recommends that you don't do that. One thing I probably could have liked the. Uh, Longbow 2 did it, and Gunship 2000 did it, was, uh, you know, you could take half loads if you don't anticipate uh, needing to take on uh, a whole lot of weaponry, or if you realize it's like, yeah, I want to go a little bit lighter, you know, would have been nice just to have like a 7-pack of rockets, rather than the full 19, although granted you are pretty light, you are pretty uh, light with the full rocket load anyways. 
It's one thing I could have liked, especially for like recon ops where you're going, yeah, you want to sell the illusion that, yeah, you are somewhat armed, but you know, it's like, you're not armed to the teeth, armed. It's like, yeah, you can carry 16 Hellfires. No, they don't recommend you do that unless you are really going all out to for full armor hunting from a distance. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. Copy, weapons free. Tank position. Hellfire away. All right, gonna turn on the laser. Firing hellfire. Firing hellfire. Primary target in sight. Twelve o'clock. All right. Missile away. Firing hellfire. All right. Well, it shot something else, so I should have turn on the lock on after launch uh, profile. Easy peasy. Like uh, with the rest of the armor out, don't have to worry any, anything else. Okay, we're done. Let's go. to be a little bit more aware this time, but to say in the interest of time. They just might give you a medal for this mission, sir. Yep, they will. Scooter, cleared for landing. Pilot's discretion. As long as I land in the clearing, it's all nice and good. Call that enemy territory. It's like uh, just outside the concrete. Oh, it's enemy territory.
It's kind of like that episode where the Simpsons visit Australia. It's like, oh, here it's American soil. Or, yeah, here in the embassy grounds, yeah, it's like, okay, it's American territory. But outside, no, nope, it's there. And then Homer gets punched in the face for just uh, <laughs> abusing the line of territory. Or the separating line. Just uh, stepping outside the gate and then coming back in. Uh, and I kind of don't consider this done. Uh, you get a ribbon if you uh, do all six of these, uh, or if you pass all six. It's Tiger Cage. Destroy armor. Clear all helo landing zones of all threats. Oh, fun. Take off uh, after the Kiowas leave. And also for the sake of gameplay, uh, even though the longbow isn't out yet, you can fly uh, with a longbow. So if you're just wondering, it's like, okay, how can I do this if uh, Eastcraft at the time had a uh, radar guided craft? It's like, oh, okay. Yeah, the Kiowa Warriors can defend themselves if they are the Kiowa Warrior spec. Usually, uh, they'll have a little, uh, I want to say a little machine gun, along with either a rocket pod, stingers, or a pair of Hellfires to help defend themselves. And uh, you get to fly the Kiowa in Longbow too. The nice thing about it is just that mast-mounted side where you can uh, place things for artillery from very far away, or... Primary target in sight, 2 o'clock. Okay. Copy. So... Optics. I don't think I need clear to filter these guys out. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. I just want to hold. thing about a, a longbow suite is that you also have a two auxiliary optical systems for a daytime hunting. But it's like you don't have to use the FLIR for everything. Sometimes they recommend you don't use the FLIR uh, during some 
daytime operations if the terrain's a little bit too hot or humid. Sometimes just a regular old camera is what you need. Looks like we're good. Cleared out everything in waypoints two and three. Let's move along the axis to three and then a go to four from there.
looks like the car was landed somewhere, but... It was just launch a pair of rockets. Mission accomplished. Great job, sir. The other thing that Longbow had, uh, that I also brought up with Akaya was, uh, for the resources, you also had a resource constraint system, and, uh, depending on Scooter, cleared for landing. how much you wanted to set the difficulty, it's like, okay, are you gonna resupply, uh, earlier, later, or, uh, or at some other time? Like, do you want to resupply after every two days, five days, or uh, seven days, or stuff like that? And, yeah, especially, like, with the resource conservation, because, yeah, the Kiowas already had a seven-pack of rockets. I mean, there were a couple of things that were unlimited, so the Blackhawk uh, guns were unlimited because uh, you either have the, the heavy guns or uh, just the Vulcan cannons that could only kill infantry. Especially like with the, the Kiowa, yeah, it's like, their 50 cows were unlimited, so you didn't have to worry about that, but just the fact that they had like uh, pairs of Hellfires, pairs of Stingers, and uh, seven packs of rocket launchers, I'm going, why can't you do that with uh, a longbow? You know, give them seven packs of rockets if, uh, you know, you're going to be using MPSMs uh, all up the wazoo because you were mobile Sam hunting all day. One thing I'll give uh, that credit for is uh, giving you uh, a four-pack uh, of either laser-guided or uh, radar-guided hellfires. If you're going, okay, I need like uh, I need a few things to take out with the laser hellfires, and I need a few things to take out with the radar-guided ones. I'm like, okay, that's fine. I just wish they had like lighter packs of rockets uh, for the longbows, and heck, even for uh, for here, it's like yeah, four-pack of hellfires. Uh, you know, seven packs of rockets, if you want to go light, then I don't have a problem with that. The other thing I kind of wish that was in this game that Gunship 2000 also did was uh, give you uh, 
AIM-9 Sidewinders as an air-to-air -air option for pylon mounting because there's a handful of missions in this game that require you to take out a, a large amount of uh, helicopters and uh, there's only so much just going lightweight with just four stingers and a pack of rockets will help you. Especially if you need to take down like six to eight hinds if both of those take a double uh, stinger to bring down. Tiger Cage is out of the way. Restless Stallion. After Restless Stallion, I'm gonna try to do Ruby 7 again. This is more what, uh, armor hunting? Yep. Mark Chester to that LZ out there. Intercept and destroy PDF infantry. It's moving toward the chaos. Okay. Now, usually I bring MPSM if I know for sure there's probably going to be a light armor or it's dominant with light MPR armor. Power up. Shelf test. Set. Volume. You can use the laser guidance system for radar guided hellfires, but there's a specific uh, set of actions you need to do when using those. As in, you gotta turn the seekers on to lock on after launch mode and just fire away. I believe that only works in Longbow 2. I'm not sure about the first one. That is a big, God forbid, your longbow gets damaged, but if, uh, if you are, it's like, uh, what were you doing? Uh, not launching from a safe angle. And there's a handful of uh, auto-generated missions that'll say, okay, you have to bring laser-guided hellfires because you might have some seals on the ground that'll designate this building for you. Your job is to destroy this particular building when they find out which one it is. Struggling to climb up the hills is probably the biggest detriment. And there's one thing in this game I know that's missing, and it's mostly because I play Comanche Gold a lot. Trees! Deadly trees. Everybody. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. Yep. Copy. Weapons free, sir.
primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. So if we hover, and uh, it's away. let's take a nice long firing session. be a lot better just to fly low and around the features rather than just putting the engine through its paces uh, trying to force its way up hills. thing you can do is just follow the terrain.
And in most other missions, uh, just in the campaign, you want to cruise in at around 40 and 40. That way you're nice, you're low, you're slow. You won't have that. Anyone searching for you, just wondering, it's like, this is blur on my screen. Scooter cleared for landing, pilot's discretion. Ta-da! I just, if I want to get that one medal, I better be able to get this part right. So that way that'll say, hey, I've passed all six of these. APR 39, power up, shelf test, set, on, five. successful campaign here guys
Group site, 11 o'clock. Threat front, bandit, 12 o'clock. Roger. Attacking your target. Help our way. Bro, I didn't want to watch, watch that against one person. Target in sight, 12 o'clock. Threat front, hot. Damn. Firing hill guard. Good shot, sir. Missile away. All right. Engaging with cannon. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock, threat front. Hellfire away. Hellfire away. Firing hellfire. Hot damn. Hellfire away. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock, threat front, hot, damn, engaging with cannon, engaging with cannon, hot, damn, engaging with cannon, firing, hellfire, all right. Good shot, sir, engaging with cannon, engaging with cannon, hellfire away. You're 12 o'clock. Hot. Damn. Good shot, sir. Primary target in sight. 11 o'clock. Copy. Engaging your target, sir. Engaging with cannon. Okay. Let's uh, get ourselves a uh, good angle. Bank. No. I asked her. Your 12 o'clock. Roger. Attacking your target, sir. Primary target in sight. 11 o'clock. Hellfire away. Good shot, sir. Missile away. Good shot, sir. Primary target in sight, 9 o'clock. Missile away. All right. That's all of them, right? Safeties because I don't. Yeah, I don't think I was supposed to destroy the hangar too soon. Destroy the jet or the hangar too soon.
Check out all the AAA. Check out almost everything else. I'm just wondering why they don't want the land. Seals are there, but... So we just have to guard the SEAL team and come in, huh? Target in sight, 3 o'clock. Copy that. Engaging your target, sir. Copy. Engaging your target. Missile away. Kill all the SAM sites. Engaging with cannon. That's why. Engaging with cannon. 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 Got to wait for the guns to cool down after like 50 or 100 rounds. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. And safety's on. Okay, I didn't destroy all the SAM sites or enough of them. Okay, that explains everything. At least explains a good chunk. Yeah, I would have thought it's like if you cleared all the SAMs, the payloads would land. At least that's how it was on previous runs, or maybe I just had the AI setting a little bit too high for my liking. I don't know, five should be adequate enough. Safety's on. Safety's off. Turns out I just didn't kill all of them. Let's see. That one over in the corner is the thing that clown to me and my wingman. I'm... That makes a lot of sense now. Alright, I'm just gonna take a little break after landing. Probably just get some more lemonade prep then the water bottle filled up again and we'll be heading to uh, Desert Storm. Just put the thing on fast. I've already done this mission and for the third time. I kind of don't need to Rush through all this stuff again. I kinda don't care. Let's just land.
why the clear was taking so long to move. I had the camera zoomed all the way in. So, Operation Desert Storm. Fine. Okay. This is a norm with these strike dock. with 23s in CPU forms. Okay. Warlock B. Straight flush. Two spoon rests. Okay. Okay, so here are we. Normandy. Let's get to this.
APR 39. Power up. Shelf test. Set. Volume. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. APR 39. Operation. Scooter cleared for takeoff. Pilot's discretion. It's just the two of us. Thought we were. Okay. Really, it's just the two of us. This is supposed to be a four-man blinding operation, not not just two taking on a front. little radar system. I know where the SAM sites are. Well, I don't want to waste too much uh, just trying to get past them, because otherwise we'll have nothing to shoot with. Serve ammunition as much as we can. Triple A, front. Like, uh, poke out eyes, uh, the sand vehicles. Triple A, we can fly around. Triple A, I don't really care about because at least we can fly past our envelopes. Or at least just uh, fly to enemy armor. You were nine o'clock. Fly around to get, not get noticed by them. Just really the SA8s. Sam sighted. You were nine o'clock. We're worried about. If there's any SA9s that I'm really worried. Okay, 
case in point. Trying to take out most of the uh, enemy armor. You were nine o'clock. The radar arrays with the uh, triple A. You were nine o'clock. Rockets and then. Black guy in their radar coverage net. Alright, just save the rest. Hellfires, and then we'll just pick off any other SAM sites as we go along. SAM site front. tell the wingman to be on weapons hold. Even if you ask him to cover you, he's probably going to try to knock out every other... Evasive action. Now. There's SAM sites in the way. Oh, shit. Evasive action. Now. Threat front. I am lucky I had the hill behind me and that target. Sam side at your nine o'clock. Shit. It's too close for coming. Oh shit. 
taking out those same sets. Is the clearing out bad good? Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Yeah, I'm skirting the floor a little bit too hard here. Everything, everything. Threat front, firing up fire. Wait, is this Sam site front? Hold for a second. Let me just take that damn thing out. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Roger, attacking your targets are firing hellfire. Sam site, you're 12 o'clock. So yeah, the difference between Enemy armor, 12 lock on before and after launch. Well, before is assuming you already have a target beforehand, and you know it's like just one shot, one kill. Lock on after you can ripple fire with it. It's just that the missiles will take a higher arc than normal, and it's also good for pop-up attacks. Say like you know there's a Sam site, but then you know you want to be able to high find cover and uh, go. Oh, uh, there's a Sam site all the way down that clearing. It's like crap. It's gonna see me if I. Uh, Stick up for the hill for more than 10 armor. seconds. Now I gotta learn to employ that tactic a bit more. You, know, you can also use lock on after launch with uh, the radar guided hellfires too. Uh, you know, you can drop priority fire zone uh, on one of the display screens and. Uh, all of your missiles armor, launch into that area, we'll find them on their own.
Yeah, the encoder blew itself. I guess it doesn't like the donut bouncing around. near miss uh, those few other SAM sites I think uh, I did fine just adequate enough but at least I didn't get damaged but he had shot and killed scooter cleared for landing pilot's discretion I have to wonder where the other guy is, because this is technically a two-person aircraft. and destroy. Locate armor, locate armor. Okay. Six, eight, nine, triple A. Right. Get artillery and air support. So we get the <laughs> forget on our side. Last time location of the armor column fall is supposed to be to As Nasseria, am I reading that correctly? Okay, and destroy the armor column, which according to our intelligence consists mostly T-72s with perhaps a few air defense vehicles. Okay. Intercept and destroy T-72s moving east on Highway 8 from uh, Mala to reinforce Republican Guard units west of us in this area. Okay. okay. What air defense are we looking at? So we got 23s. Saint Nines. Alright. Yeah, usually their rule of thumb is call artillery. You only get one fire mission rather than like the perhaps a trio or a dozen you get in Comanche. And then Actually, it's called, if you see significant AAA, then call the fighters. Otherwise, if you see significant SAM sites, call artillery on the SAM sites. I'm going to go with a 16 Hellfire build here. It's destroying armor is pretty much going to be everything I'm doing. As for my wingman, I'm going to give him HE rockets. MPSMs aren't going to do diddly against armor. At least, uh... Battle tank armor. APR Shelf test. Set. Volume. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. APR. Thirty nine. Operational. Scooter cleared for takeoff. Pilot's discretion. up. So, one for artillery, two for airstrike. Alright. That is a lot of SA-9s. 
So yeah, we're just gonna have to head to waypoint point two. Also, um, if for some reason you hit the barrier of the map, which can happen in this mission, you know, you're probably won't hit. So don't stray too far north or when you hit the waypoint, turn east the first chance you get. Sometimes uh, I don't want to use the flare out in daytime in the desert. Enemy armor, 12 o'clock. Turns get to be a little bit too hot for my liking. Triple A, front. Let's steer clear of the air defense. Trying to stay out of the range out of the SA-9s. Crossing into enemy territory, sir. Triple-A, front. Enemy armor ahead. Nuisance in the world. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Firing in the Triple A, front. All right. Sam's that's guarding that convoy.
Triple A, you're 12 o'clock. Sam site, you're three o'clock. Hellfire away. Hot damn, threat front. Triple A, you're 12 o'clock. Copy, attacking your target. Firing Hellfire. 75% Hellfire's 100% rocket, 100% cannon ammo, sir. Primary target in sight, 11 o'clock. All right, cool. You got a visual. Enemy armor, you're 3 o'clock. Triple A, you're 12 o'clock. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. We're taking fire, sir. Artillery is inbound, sir. Hell fire away. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Hell fire away. Triple A, you're 12 o'clock. Another mobile Sam's in the area. I have your target in sight, sir. Firing Hellfire. We're Winchester Hellfire. Yeah, calling the brigade. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. Firing Hellfire. Alright. So 
Yeah, that's why I uh, let my wingman bring a cheese. Coder's just dying on me. Alright, that's fine. Barring Hill Park. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. Triple A, you're 12 o'clock. Primary target in sight. 12 o'clock. Alright. It's on the way. I need a duck. With cannon. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Shit, right. out of it. AA. Okay, it's not worth it. Twenty rounds of ammo. Okay, a thousand rounds. You, you can stop now. Weapons hold. You can stop. We've already wrecked enough of the convoy as it is, and we need to just say drop everything and go home. Like, we've already destroyed the bulk of the ground force. And the last two tanks are kind of damaged. I mean, they'll probably have to throw a shell or two somewhere, but... Let's see if the tankers are feeling, uh... They want to do that. I think our problem is just getting our ass home at this point. Triple 
delay, you are 12 o'clock. Should have saved one last hellfire for one more missile truck out there. I got a little bit too zealous. Oh, I could have just let my wingman take on it. Let's turn off the freaking donut, because if that's bouncing around and causing the elements to screw up, then I kind of don't want to have any more. AAA, you are 3 o'clock. If he's focused on me, just let my wingman take care of it. We're just gonna have to start running back full speed. Those IFVs don't have anti-air missiles, I think we're fine. Triple A, triple A, triple A. Triple A, front.
so close to home. Save the rockets for the tanks. <sighs> Damn it. Mission accomplished. Great job, sir. Doesn't feel like an accomplishment to me, but fine. Scooter cleared for landing. Pilot's discretion. Destroy our defense units. So we get artillery and we get. smooth out there. Sam site, you are 12 o'clock. Hellfire away. Enemy armor, 12 o'clock. Alright, that's one less Sam site to worry about. Armor ahead. 
stamp site, your 12 o'clock. Artillery never works in this game. Triple A, you are 
nine o'clock. I forgot translation on the left, doesn't it? On the effect. Where's that? Wait, I said there was a long track around here. Take out any of the radars in the area that'll make uh, their SAM operators' uh, lives a bit more miserable. Except for the eights and nines, they run on their own system. SAM sighted, you're nine o'clock. You're three o'clock.
Approaching target. These guys launch Mavericks. How cute. Are flashing diamonds at me. Guess they should have had a track on me. Copy. Attacking your target, sir. Hellfire away. We're Winchester Hellfire. Your rockets, man. So I have three. Okay. Let's make your way out of here. Triple A, you are nine o'clock. Yeah, I want to say squares are triple A, diamonds are Sam's. to read the manual on uh, what the RWR symbol budget was. Nice thing about it though, and this kind of comes to play for one mission in Flashpoint Korea, your RWR doesn't get badly jammed, uh, like your ASA, no, uh, not the ASA, the ASE uh, aircraft survivability equipment screen goes. Because that mission, even your ASE goes haywire, I'm going, yeah, let's just do the passive RWR where uh, Sam site, you're 12 o'clock. It doesn't get us badly uh, goofy. Okay. Right, four clicks away from me, according to laser. Alright. You're nine o'clock. Enemy armor, you are three o'clock. Just uh, try to sneak past these guys and then uh, all goes well, they won't notice me, and then ta da, we are done. Third mission out of six, I still have to do. Ugh. Number six is easy. 
relatively. I think five was one I'm not a big fan of. Was it four? Yeah, dark over. I should have ate it with that missile, but uh, just a quick realizing. Oh yeah, I can just hide behind the hill. Okay. Uh, Alright, we got another hour left. Just the part where I'm enemy armor. You were nine o'clock. Part where I'm absolutely uncertain of uh, not being able to slip past the fences is why I'm a little bit too hesitant to use time compression. I mean, for Panama, it's obvious. There's like two or three missions that benefit from it. Well, then again. Uh, Second Panama mission is like, oh right, uh, there's no uh, bad guys blocking the way. You can just uh, go home that way. I'm going ah. Sam's like front. We gotta take out that radar. Okay. Good shot, sir. Threat front. Party kill party. Sam site front. Good shot, sir. Second Lieutenant. All right. Voyager. Yeah, this is the one I was kind of dreading. This is another deep strike. Punch out air defense, and then try to move all the way back. Okay, got to liver, gotta take over our own airfield.
objective white and otherwise known as Salmon Airfield, destroy all air defense around it. Okay. Secure and Salmon Airfield so coalition forces can begin airlifting supplies in to establish FOB Cobra. Make sure you destroy all AAA and SAM sites around the airfield to allow the Helleborn airlift to arrive safely. Hmm. Forty-five thousand gallons of fuel with nearly a hundred helicopters. Hmm. Hundred thousand additional gallons of fuel along with fifty tow Humvees, two artillery batteries, fully armed, and four battalion aid stations. So we're take so we're taking a whole airfield for ourselves. Lovely. Do a 16 hell fire build and then big man will take uh, just as usual. 8 plus 19. Alright. APR 39. Power up. Shelf test. Set. Volume. 5. I just wish there were other Apaches or uh, Enemy armor. You were three some other friendly craft uh, out there doing something. Just so it doesn't feel like we're the only air wing actually doing shit out here. try to avoid AAA as much as possible. If there's any SAM sites uh, that I can't help to destroy, then fine, I'll blow them, but... I'm gonna save all that ordnance uh, for when we get to the airfield. Probably, uh, out of 16, I wanna make sure there's... I wanna make sure I at least have 12, then... Enemy armor ahead. Spend 10 on the... Airfield, well, hopefully anywhere between 8 to 10. Let's save the last 2 to 4 on Axfell. So, yeah, we got about 24 Hellfires between the two of us. She says a lot of uh, flat. A lot of flat brown and tan. Enemy armor ahead. Or more like crossing into enemy territory, sir. More like flat tan. It's like a control top. No, that's, that's not on this page. Roger. Returning to base at this time. Roger. Regrouping at this time. Enemy armor. You are three o'clock. Okay. Yeah, we gotta blow uh, every AAA that's necessary on our approach. Yeah, she blows! Good shot, sir. Enemy 
armor front. Samsung, you're 12 o'clock. Hot damn. Yeah. Let's take care of that. site, you're three o'clock. FA six, detected three o'clock. Okay, I guess we can take care of uh, this one. You're three o'clock. So we're at a perfect place to practice bobbing up. Threat, you're 12 o'clock. Primary 
target in sight, 12 o'clock. Say that the pop up optic octagon is basically your original frame of reference before you do a pop up attack. But seeing that they haven't noticed me yet. The radar that's tying them is uh, knocked out. Okay, back to transition. Back to waypoint three. All right.
I still got eight fifty hellfires left. All right. Fifty percent hellfires, one hundred percent rocket, one hundred percent cannon ammo, sir. Don't need to worry about those SA sixes. The radar with them is done. you in our way. Sam's on front. Great job, 
Just knowing this wasn't as bad as I thought. I'm guessing it's just uh, looking at the map screen, just uh, wincing at seeing how much. Uh, Scooter cleared for landing. Pilot's discretion. Coverage area. I thought I would have to look at. I got my pick of the litter in any spots. So. Those kilos, I'm fine. Scooter cleared for landing, pilot's discretion. Alright, two more. Destroy artillery. Oh. Makes my decision a lot easier. Okay. NATO icons for this stuff, or you can just do the simplified option, where they'll just tell you, okay, it's a tank, or it's an anti-air site, or it's a helicopter, or stuff like that. Alright, this one should be a relative walk in the park, relative being the operative term, but don't be surprised if I somehow die in this one. And there is one permanent career ender in one of the campaigns. Laser in the submissions. Okay. So we have other artillery to take out that artillery. And uh, we got that brigade to help us out. I'm wondering if Twitter's dying on me so much. Anything else hogging the background? You so. This is supposed to be my hardware encoder, so I kind of don't get what's going on with this particular game. There we go, why the hell it worked for Comanche Golden Mech Warrior 2, but not for this. Destroying artillery, so we got laser hellfires, duh. MPSM rockets, this is light armor we're dealing with, so... If I'm using hellfires to take out an artillery piece, I'm doing it wrong. Enemy armor ahead. Oh, no. 
So use the Hellfire to take out missile launchers. Use the rockets to take out the artillery pieces. Easy enough. Sam site, your 12 o'clock. Target in sight, one o'clock. Firing Hellfire. Hot damn. We're crossing into enemy territories. Good shot, sir. Copy. Attacking your target, sir. Firing Hellfire. Enemy armor front. Good shot, sir. Primary target in sight, one o'clock. Roger. Copy. Engaging your target. Keep playing, give me three o'clock. Enemy armor, twelve o'clock. Copy that. Engaging your target, sir. Primary target in sight, twelve o'clock. Yeah, it was a couple bullet holes in this. Triple A, you were 12 o'clock. Firing no fire. Primary target in sight, 9 o'clock. Hot damn. Big oof. Triple A, you are 12 o'clock. Good shot, sir. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. All right. Engaging with cannon. Good shot, sir. Engaging with cannon. Shot, sir. Triple A, you are nine o'clock. All right. Engaging with cannon. Hot damn. Hellfire away. Seventy-five percent hellfire. Seventy-five percent rocket. One hundred percent cannon ammo, sir. Hot damn. Threat front. Close to that was half the center down, sir. Better head back to getting the armor front. Engaging with cannon. Engaging with cannon. And Oops. Sam 
outside front. Roger. stuck in place. Basically, I have to relearn this whole game from scratch.
Yeah, unfortunately, artillery is not really Sail good site, at anything but destroying just lightly armored stuff. Sad. I mean, the SAM site's pretty much uh, part of the most of my concerns, and I'm going to be making every effort to avoid them. I'm going to be avoiding the associated AAAs as well. I'm guessing I probably have the difficulty slider on one or two the last time I did this, no wonder why I thought these missions were easy. Now I set the difficulty factor to 5 out of 10. If you want to ask me to do 10 out of 10, I heard there was a whole... Pretty much I'll just say, uh, yeah, let's ask a real pilot how they, they would do these missions. I'd probably follow those to the letter. Sam side at your nine o'clock.
I don't really have to worry too much about the tanks and the IFEs. Uh, it's only when their 50 decals come together is when I start to have problems. Just really the ZSUs I should be more concerned about. Wait, what? Ah, oh. This is the route home. or something. Hot damn. On our way, sir. Primary target in sight, 12 o'clock. 
100% rocket, 100% cannon ammo, sir. Sam site, you're 12 o'clock. Wait, where the... Uh, fine, we'll do it ourselves. Thanks for the assist, mister. Wingman will break his hold fire command if you are in clear and immediate danger. game for over a year, or at least consistently over a year. Scooter cleared for landing. 
pilot's discretion. things and well my wingman ended up saving my ass and the brigade saved my ass Vehicles to your destination. Alright, let's go help our guys out and then we can call it a night. APR 39, power up, self test, set. Target in sight, 12 o'clock. 
Target in sight, 11 o'clock.
Alright, I'm out of missiles. We're done. I'm just way too inclined just to try to get this stuff over with. And I kind of paid the price for that, but then again, patience really isn't my strong suit for it, this sort of thing. So, mm. <sighs> another four hour flight simulator night. Not exactly how I great job, sir. envisioned it, but eh. rather than four hours to do 32. <sighs> Scooter, cleared for landing. Pilot's discretion. Next time I do this, we'll touch a Baltic hammer. Oh, man, oh man. Being for quite the barn burner tonight. Burn. I've already been through the barn burner. Next time it's gonna be an even bigger barn burner. Alright, so tomorrow I'll be doing a Banshee 3 co op. Then, uh, bunch of other uh, games starting uh, January 8th. Oh <sighs> boy. Yep. I'm gonna go through the gauntlet of role-playing games again. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. In the meantime, stay calm, stay cool, stay collected, stay safe out there, and I will see you guys next time.